Hi everyone and welcome to my channel or oh, welcome back if you've been here before so in case you weren't able to tell you probably were I'm at the airport not just any airport I'm at Heathrow Terminal 5 which also means uh, you can't really tell right now but um, if you're not aware Terminal 5 is definitely the best when it comes to luxury shopping. So they have a Chanel, they have a Louis Vuitton, they have Gucci, basically everything. So I already went inside Chanel, the selection was amazing in terms of bags, but also in terms of jewelry, like costume jewelry. I'm used to like at maximum like one and a half, maybe two trays with like duplicates of uh, Chanel earrings. They had four trays all different um, earrings so I was really tempted but even the like tiny studs are kind of on the pricey side anyway not the point of today's vlog today's vlog is gonna be like me showing you around um, Heathrow Terminal 5 when it comes to some of the luxury boutiques I also already went inside Louis Vuitton and they just dropped like by the way today is the 1st of January so New Year's Day which is also the reason why I'm running on two hours of sleep so if um, I'm a little uh, less energetic uh, this time around, you probably um, know why, because the lack of sleep. Anyway, I also went inside Louis Vuitton and they dropped two new collections today, actually. The denim collection is out, which I took a look at, and a new subcategories or like subline of the Capucine, the Mini Me Capucine, actually, which comes with the most adorable, like tiny SLG kind of version of the Capucine, which you can attach to a strap. So anyway, this vlog is going to be filled with eye candy. I hope you're down for that and hey if you're new um, consider subscribing my name is Leslie so glad to have you here on my channel I talk about all things luxury in particular handbags but I cover a wide range of topics I film unboxings reviews shopping vlogs or like window shopping vlogs um, yeah to show you what's out show you what's new and uh, yeah if any of that sounds like a thing I would love for you to join my little YouTube family and before I make this intro any longer than it has to be let's get going We got everything we need right here Wine and burning chemistry You and me alone You and me alone Inside of our embassy Everything we need right here Make me sing along, sing along I never thought I'd ever be stuck by you Ooh. I never thought I'd ever be stuck by you Oh, watch me All right, so as I said, my first stop was Chanel and I adore this bag. It was a combination of leather and tweed and I love the, like, on the one hand, it's fairly classic, but it's not like a classic flap per se, which also reflected in the price, which <laughs> I appreciate. I mean, we're talking about Chanel bags. It's still fairly expensive, but like half of what like the equivalent in terms of a classic flap would be. So I think like, yeah, I did take a picture of the price love this bag because it's mostly black with a little touch of like white and running throughout and obviously tweed is such a staple for chanel so i adore this bag but um yeah wasn't prepared to be buying a bag especially running on two hours of sleep i usually tend to not make my wisest decisions when i'm <laughs> sleep deprived but um anyway adore this bag And I also went to Gucci actually. Not a Gucci girl, usually. I mean, I did used to own a Gucci Soho disco bag like a couple of years ago, but I ended up selling it. Didn't end up working out for me, but I digress. So the reason why I went inside the Gucci boutique is because I saw this like iridescent uh, line online and I wanted to check it out in person. And I think it comes in three different colorways. So a blue, like a turquoise and this pinkish like purple colored style. So there we are. And I also made sure to include the prices. Yeah, because I wear so much black, like something a little more like light. Yeah. 
That's cute. And the last stop, fortunately my train was delayed so I had plenty of time to roam around Louis Vuitton because I did mention at the beginning that like that day um, multiple new collections had dropped. So the Vernis collection, the denim collection and uh, also the Mini Me Capucines which I'm gonna show you later on. So loads of stock and the Louis Vuitton SA was so lovely. She was really trying to sell that bag, especially the Capucines but in a super nice way. Just like we ended up chatting and yeah she was so nice. You better be there when I shake. Watch me rockin' if I can't stop. If I should fall, just go ahead. Go and catch me, baby. So cute. <laughs> yeah, you do get like really good goodies here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And does like the <laughs> ring right here detach as well? Or is uh, that fixed? This does not, no. Okay. Oh no, I tell a lie, let me see. Oh, it does. Let's see. And then it does. Like, a tiny little like there metal are. strap on both sides and they have like a two in one. Exactly. <laughs> it would just be, you know, if that was for sale on its own, that would be a few thousand. Yeah. So you get your two. So pretty. And the other two ones are bigger sizes, right? They are bigger so, sizes, yeah, but the same, yeah. it's exactly the same little bag that comes with the mm. as well. And that already does it for today's video. A bit of a shorter one, but I really hope you enjoyed it nonetheless and that I was able to capture like some interesting goodies in case you were interested in some of the new collections in particular when it comes to Louis Vuitton. If you enjoyed today's video, I would love for you to give this video a thumbs up and also consider subscribing. Maybe this is your first time watching one of my videos. Maybe it's your fifth video and you haven't subscribed yet. It's totally free for you, but it would mean the world to me. So if you can help me out and maybe at some point in 2024, hopefully I'm going to get to 4,000 subscribers. That would be amazing. But yeah, again, thanks so much for watching and I'm going to catch you in one of my next videos. Bye.